Does anyone know what archival shed syndrome is? You know, who will know? Tell us, Mr. Audio. In the 1970s, manufacturers changed the formulation of recording tape to achieve a better signal-to-noise ratio. This produced a tape that could record more signal and therefore provide a greater dynamic range. However, an unfortunate side effect was that these new tapes were susceptible to a condition known as archival shed or sticky tape syndrome. What happens is that as the tape is stored for a period of time, the binder that holds the oxide onto the tape picks up moisture from the humidity in the air. The next time the tape is played, it will slow down and eventually come to a complete stop as it becomes glued to the heads and guides. Most people who see this happen for the first time are generally convinced that the tape recorder has failed, but the problem is with the tape. The remedy for this is to drive the moisture out of the tape with a convection oven or dehumidifier. After that, the tape will usually play with no problem. Tapes manufactured prior to 1970 don't have this issue. Thanks, Mr. Audio. For more interesting facts about sound, visit Mr. Audio at soundimages.com.